This all looks fine. Charles, shh. I wasn't talking. Shh. Olivia Crawford just got off the elevator. My arrival for the commissionership. She's here right now. I've got to come up with a confident opening salvo. Think, Raymond. Think. Hello, Raymond. Olivia, you have a little bit of goop in your eye. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry to barge in like this, but I have a source on the nominating committee. They're making their recommendation to the mayor at the end of next week, and it seems that John Kelly is going to beat out both of us. Big shocker. The straight white man wins again. Exactly. Oh, that was my complaint about Owen winning Top Chef Junior, and you guys all acted like I was crazy. Half of the committee supports John Kelly, and the other half is divided between the two of us. We're splitting the vote. So for either of us to have a chance, one of us needs to step aside. Exactly. You should drop it. Is what you said to yourself in the mirror this morning instead of checking your eye for goop. And I agree. You should drop out. Is what you said to yourself in the mirror this morning while polishing your head. Don't you think it's time New York had its first female commissioner? What about its first openly gay commissioner? Yes, that would be vital and important if you weren't one million years old. You do know that exaggeration is the huckster's crutch. Also, I come off quite youthful. You just said huckster's crutch. Step aside, Grandpa. Did you hear anything from Olivia? She's not going to step down, and neither am I. We're at an impasse. Okay, well, Jean and I have been discussing the situation, and... We think we know what you need to do. Well, what is that? Whisper campaign. It's the best way to bring down an enemy if you don't want to get your hands dirty. How do you think I stole the Cheese Club presidency away from Bruce? Whisper. I heard he thought Gamma Bear was goat cheese. And how do you think I got Janet and her horrible daughter Dakota to drop out of Baby Bongo's class? Whisper. I heard Dakota has foot and mouth disease. Sir, you have to give us permission to do this. Weaponize our sweet little mouths. Uh, how are we on the same side of this? This is not a strategy I'd normally entertain. However, challenging Olivia publicly is out of the question. So, what do you have in mind? Whispers. Whispers. Yes, I know, but what specifically are the words that you would be whispering? She lied on her resume. She's a shoplifter. She planted evidence. She seduced a priest. She pads her stats. She's sort of stanky, I heard. No, no. I want to be commissioner of the NYPD, but I want to achieve it honorably. There has to be another way. There isn't. Whispers. Sir, Olivia Crawford is on her way up. I know, I invited her. Did you change your mind about the whispering? Because we came up with some dandies. I heard she's a day drinker. I heard she doesn't like me. I actually did hear that. Officer Thomas told me. I told you I wouldn't be doing that. I've come up with a different plan, and I've implemented it. Raymond! Hello? You have goop in your eye. No, I don't. I rinsed my eyes before you arrived. Fine. What's this about? I wanted to let you know that I've thought it over, and I've been acting selfishly. I wasn't considering what's best for this city. That's why, before you got here, I sent a letter withdrawing my name from the commissioner's race. What? what? You're young and smart and progressive and a hell of a lot better than John Kelly. I've been waiting my entire career for a commissioner like you. Captain. If I have to be the bigger person to open the doors to change, then... I also uh... felt bad. And I also sent in a letter withdrawing my name from contention. We just made John Kelly commissioner. Not if we get those letters back before anyone reads them. Are you too old to run? Are you too inexperienced to know that power walking is a far more efficient and sustainable method of hurrying? Burn. 